up YouTube? It's your girl Raven here and today I'm doing a pregnancy update. As you guys know, I just found I just found out I was pregnant. Uh, <laughs> about to have the baby. And you just found out that you're pregnant? What's up YouTube? It's your girl Raven Alexis here and today I'm doing a pregnancy update from the time I first found out I was pregnant up until now. I am 24 weeks, will be 25 weeks on Thursday. And if you guys know, I just found out the gender of my little bundle of joy. I will leave the link down in the comments of the gender reveal. If you want to check that out, please do. Stay tuned. So for this video, I'm going to give you guys information on my pregnancy that I couldn't share with you guys during the gender reveal. So I found out I was pregnant December 10, 2016, and I had my first ultrasound December 28, 2016, and I was six weeks and two days. During the first trimester, symptoms I had were I was really, really tired to the point where I did not want to get up and go nowhere with no one. I didn't want to drive myself to school or anything like that. Um, I also had like a situation where I felt like I had the flu, but it wasn't the flu. They said it was a really, really bad sinus infection and I was coughing, <clears throat> sneezing. I had no taste in my mouth and it was to the point where they said I could only take Tylenol because if you're pregnant, you can't take anything else. And then I also had another serious case of a sinus infection where my ears were ringing and it was like mucus coming up a lot. So I guess that would be like the pregnancy symptoms I had. Also during the first trimester, I had no morning sickness and still up until now, I haven't threw up not one time. Um, at one point, I did feel a little nauseous to where I felt like it was not throw up, but like dizzy, nauseous, I guess you could say. Um, I also had breast tenderness, so like my boobs felt really, really like soft and it was kind of hurting a little bit. And then I also got this thing where I still have to this day. From Christmas up until now, I have this bad taste in my mouth. And I cannot think of the word they had for it. It starts with a D. But I don't know, like I still cannot get rid of it. It's not like a taste where, I can't really describe it, but I know at the beginning, it was like as soon as I ate something, I could eat anything. As soon as I ate something, wherever I get done swallowing it, it's like this little sour taste that come in my mouth and I have to chew gum right after. Um, after a while, it kind of went down a little bit to where now I can talk to you guys without chewing gum. But I still have like, right now it's taste in my mouth, but it's not as bad. At one point, I could not drink water at all because it seemed like water triggered the nasty in my mouth and it was the most disgusting thing ever. Okay, so on to my second trimester. As I mentioned before, I'm 24 weeks and I'll be 25 weeks on Thursday. Um, my second trimester started roughly around 14 weeks and what I can remember was still feeling tired but not like I felt in the first trimester. Um, I had this thing where my stomach was stretching and I can like feel it stretching and you ever like had the experience where when something itches it means it's stretching on your skin that's basically how my stomach was um and then I also had like mild stomach pains it wasn't cramps but it was like poking pain and my doctor told me that it's just that the uterus is growing so it hurts inside so I had that for a little minute and right now I'm having back aches like crazy right now it's like my back is tired I need to pull up behind me but they said it's come with the territory and my third trimester that'll be worse another symptom that I had I started getting roughly around 20 weeks it might be a little TMI but I am having breast leakage and they say it's colostrum coming out um it is really bad to the point where I had to buy nursing pads. Like right now I got on nursing pads, I'm gonna my bra. Um, I plan on breastfeeding once I have my baby, so I'm pretty sure I'm gonna have like the breast leakage more often once the baby comes. But from now I have like, it's kind of, it happens in the morning and at night. And it's really, really bad at night. And more of it comes out of my right boob instead of my left boob. So my doctor says okay, but any of y'all have that too, just you know, let me know, because most people say it comes after labor, but mine has started at 20 weeks. So as far as baby kicks and the baby gender, I felt the baby move at 20 weeks. It was literally 20 weeks the exact same day. Um, it was around five o'clock in the morning. I woke up and I was like, feeling like my stomach like this, doing like this kind of. And I was like, oh my God, oh my God. And I woke up aging and I was like, feel this, feel this. We found out the gender of the baby at 21 weeks. Well, we didn't find out, we went through the ultrasound and then I gave the packet thing to my sister and she held it for us until the general reveal. And we did the general reveal 
And when I was 22 weeks in, I want to say maybe 22 weeks in three days, if I remember correctly. And we found out that we are having a boy. Yay! And one more thing a lot of people are telling me now is that my face is getting fatter. I went to the doctor and she was like, oh, I can finally tell you're pregnant. Can look at your face. And so I guess that's kind of the thing. When I look at old pictures, my face was a little slimmer. Um, obviously, I am starting to show now, which I will show you guys at the end of this video. And also now, um, you can see the baby moving and kicking from not even touching the stomach. Like, my stomach moves. It's kind of like he's like... Sometimes I feel like surfing or something, or something. But my stomach goes like this, so I get like come up a little bit. Um, I've recorded a couple of times, but literally every time I try to record him kicking or moving around, he stops. So yeah, that is all for my pregnancy symptoms from my first trimester and my second trimester leading up to now. Um, I will be going into my third trimester in two weeks. Like I said, I am 24 weeks and I'll be 25 weeks this Thursday. So my weeks change every Thursday and my due date is August 17th. So now I'm just gonna show you guys my stomach. So, ooh, look at that, it's so big now. So like I said, I am 24 weeks, and I'll be 25 weeks on Thursday. As you can see, I have like a little line, and it goes up. It's not as dark a pill as it is down there. And my belly button hasn't popped out fully. Yeah, that's baby boy. All right, so that concludes the video for today of my pregnancy update slash symptoms of my first trimester and second trimester. If you guys like the video, please leave a comment down below and also subscribe if you want to see more of my pregnancy journey and after baby boy is born. And 